So today we're going to be reviewing three fragrances from Atelier. Welcome back to the channel guys, it's Nick at Talking Review and if you haven't done so already hit that subscribe button to give this little cheeky face a big smile. So I've got three fragrances or samples from the house of Atelier. So the first one is Pamelo Paradise. So when I smell this fragrance what it reminds me of is a fresh fruit that's been opened and it's just mouth watering. The dry down on this one isn't that great and I prefer the opening smell to stay linear throughout the fragrance. So this next one is called Veni Incensi. I believe the name Incensi means wild or mad so it's sort of like wild vanilla. I really like my vanilla fragrances so I was really excited to try this one. So what I got from the opening and the overall fragrance was creamy coffee. I wasn't a big fan of this fragrance. I'm not a huge lover of coffee fragrances. So the combination of the coffee and vanilla didn't really gel with me and I just felt like I smelt like a creamy coffee. The last fragrance is Orange Sanguine. So this one lives up to its name. It opens up with a huge orange smell. It leans more towards the, the blood orange and you'd probably Reminds me of like orange peels. It does then settle down where it's not too sweet or too bitter. Again, with this one, it loses that sparkle that you've got in the opening and the dry down isn't as fantastic as the opening. If I was to rank them, the knee in Sensi would be number three, then Orange Sanguine, and then top would be the Pomelo Paradise. Drop me a comment down below. Have you tried any fragrances from this house? And what was your favorite? Make sure to hit that subscribe button. We've got lots of great content on the way from the fragrance side to the movie side. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you on the next review.